Hello, welcome to SoundOp Tutorials. In this video, we will focus on operations to edit clips. A clip is a short period of sound on the timeline. The sound is from an audio file and can be processed before output. To add clips, you can drag files from the browser panel or insert a clip from the audio file editor. You can also drag files from File Explorer or use the Insert Files command. When importing a WAV file, you can choose to use the original file or make a copy in the MixSpace folder. And you can set your preference on the MixSpace preference page. When adding multiple files, there is an option to position clips. And you can set your preference on the MixSpace Clips preference page. To select clips, when the Object Selection tool is activated, click to select a clip. Hold the Control key and click to select or deselect a clip. Drag out a rectangle to select clips within the rectangle. When the Time Selection tool is activated, click the title bar to select a clip. Hold the control key and click the title bar to select or deselect a clip. Drag out a rectangle to select clips within the rectangle and select the time range. And you can also use the commands in the select menu to select clips. When multiple clips are selected, you can group the selected clips. When clips are grouped, you can click a clip to select all clips in the group. And you can suspend grouping to disable this behavior temporarily. Most properties of a clip can be edited in the clip panel. And you can edit the properties of multiple clips in the group panel. To change the name of a clip, click the clip name and edit. To change the color of a clip, click the color button in the clip panel. To change the name of a group, click the group name and edit. To change the group color, click the color button in the group panel. To adjust the position of clips, click and drag the clips. To copy clips to a new place, hold the Alt key, then click and drag. To trim a clip, drag the left edge and right edge of a clip. The edges of the clips will align automatically when multiple clips are selected. And you can set the group length in the group panel. When looping is enabled for a clip, you can loop the source audio in the clip. When the shift tool is selected, you can shift the source audio in the clip. To set the position and length of clips precisely, edit the position and length in the clip panel and group panel. To change the position of clips slightly, use the nudge commands. To align clips, use the align commands. And you can lock a clip in time to prevent its time position from changed unpurposed. To change the clip's volume, you can mute the clip. Set the clip's gain. And apply a gain envelope to the clip. When multiple clips are selected, you can adjust the volume of all clips and set the same volume for all clips in the group panel. To fade in and out a clip, you can drag the handle in the timeline. When multiple clips are selected, all fade curves can be adjusted simultaneously. And you can edit the fade curve precisely in the clip panel.
To set the same fade curve for all clips, you can edit in the group panel. To crossfade clips, make sure crossfade is enabled for both clips. And crossfade will be automatically created when dragging clips. To stretch clips, you can drag the bottom corner of a clip. When multiple clips are selected, you can stretch all clips simultaneously. And you can edit the stretch ratio and pitch precisely in the clip panel. To set the same stretch ratio, stretch length, or pitch for all clips, you can edit in the group panel. To change the output of a clip, you can also add effects in the FX rack of the clip panel. When a clip is above other clips, only the top clip will be audible. You can send the top clip to the back to change the Z order. And you can set the top clip to transparent to make clips below it audible. When the selected clips are in the time selection range, the copy, cut, and delete operation will apply to part of the clips in the time selection range. Copy. Paste. Cut. Paste. Delete. You can override this behavior with commands in the edit menu. Copy clips. Paste. Cut clips. Paste. Delete clips. Delete select clips range. Delete range in selected clips. To edit clips according to time selection, you can use the commands in the edit menu. Delete range. Delete range in the selected track. Clear range. Clear range in the selected track. To split clips, you can use the split tool. Or use the split commands. Split. Split clips in all tracks. To insert silence, choose the commands in the edit menu. Insert silence. Insert silence in the selected track. Some shortcuts to edit clips. Activate the time selection tool. Activate the object selection tool. Activate the split tool. Activate the shift tool. Select all. Deselect all. Select clips to end of the track. Select next clip. Group clips. Suspend group. Nudge left. Nudge right. Nudge fast left. Nudge fast right. Nudge up. Nudge down. Trim to time selection. Trim left edge to edit cursor. Trim right edge to edit cursor. Copy. Paste. Cut. Paste. Delete. Copy clips. Paste. 
Cut clips. Paste. Delete clips. Delete selected clips range. Delete range in selected clips. Delete range. Clear range. Split. Split clips in all tracks. Well, that's all for now. Thanks for watching.